<laughs> On behalf of the Sims Township Board of Trustees, Jody Lease, Ken Bryant, my name is Phil Beck, Sims Township Trustee, and I have the honor to welcome our residents, business representatives, staff, and visiting guests to this dedication of our latest addition to Sims Township, our first building mural. This project has an interesting background. Back in 2008, the township purchased these 49 acres from the Rousey family and turned this into our ninth incredible township park. The design of what the residents named Home of the Brave Park included two construction phases based on available cash flow. Phase one was open to the public on Memorial Day weekend of 2012 and includes the shelter, playground, splash park, sports fields, and veterans memorial you see today. When the township purchased this property, it included numerous small buildings that the Rossi family used to produce their wonderful fireworks. However, based on the new park layout, all but one of the existing buildings were removed. The one remaining building before us met our criteria for location, size, and condition, and would be utilized as a park maintenance and storage building. Now that phase one of the park has been completed, and we have commenced on phase two, which includes the build out of the baseball fields behind you, this plain concrete block building in the middle of this beautiful park started to look out of place. Enter Artworks. I have had the pleasure of working with Artworks downtown on the Banks Project, and in particular, enjoyed observing how Artworks accomplished significant public participation in last year's Fiona mural. As it turns out, the same artist, Lucy Rice, has also created beautiful murals that graphically tell the story of other communities. She was the right fit. With the three trustees' unanimous support, we embarked on what has been a really fun and exciting journey, and the end result speaks for itself. Sims Township and Artworks fashioned this mural as a paint-by-numbers project. Sims residents participated in voting for the preferred design. And with the assistance from the Little Miami Chamber Alliance, we enlisted the volunteer help of approximately 50 Sims residents and members of the greater Sims community. But this story keeps getting better. So far, Sims has received $4,300 in donated funds from the following community businesses and community groups, of which we are grateful. The Loveland Firemen's Association, Inc., Knights of the Golden Trail, which is Chateau La Roche, Union Savings Bank, Choice One Engineering, Millennium Business Systems, Keystone Hotel Group, Wild Funeral Home, Sly Accounting, and Sherwin-Williams. <laughs> Finally, in addition to the coordination efforts of our fantastic Sims Township staff, led by our administrator, Kim LaPensi, I, like, I would like to thank the Artworks team, led by Marie Pruwich brown Laura Houston, Jim Effler, and our artists, two of which are from Sims Township. And with that, I will turn the ceremony over to Marie. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, so much. Thank you Phil. Welcome, everybody. Hello. Um, as Phil mentioned, I'm Marie Krulowicz Brown. I'm the Managing Director of Programs for Artworks, and I'm honored to be with you here today to dedicate this beautiful artwork, but also our first summer mural for 2019. So really excited um, to be sharing this experience with you today. We are so excited to celebrate Sims Township Alive with History, our newest mural designed by Nashville-based artist Lucy Rice, as Phil was mentioning, and produced by a team of Artworks Youth Apprentices and your community members, led by lead teaching artist Jim Effler and junior teaching artist Braylon Bell. In partnership with the Sims Township Board of Trustees, 
artworks set out to transform this community park maintenance building into a work of art. A reflection of your community itself, this mural celebrates Sims and all that it offers to residents. We were delighted to have many of you come out and help us paint this mural, which we hoped fostered a sense of community pride. Community pride is something that has been at the heart of artworks for 24 years. At our core, we are a workforce development program based in the arts. All of our projects are completed by youth apprentices who are between the ages of 14 to 21 years old. And I look forward to introduce this team with you shortly. At Artworks, we create opportunities for youth to make a meaningful mark in their communities. While our youth apprentices complete these monumental works of art, they also receive training in public speaking, teamwork, financial skills, and they make lifelong friends too. I'd like to take this opportunity to, uh, welcome our gener or to welcome and thank our generous supporters on this project again, specifically the local township supporters that Phil was mentioning. Um, so let's give them all one more round of applause. Thank you so much. Artworks would also like to thank our 2019 mural season sponsor, the Procter & Gamble Fund, and our ongoing sponsors, Artswave, the City of Cincinnati, the Ohio Arts Council, and the Carol Ann and Ralph V. Hale Jr. U.S. Bank Foundation. Because Lucy Rice wasn't able to join us today, I wanted to share with you her artist statement about this mural so you could get a glimpse into how this design came together. The wraparound mural takes the viewer on a journey throughout the rich history of Sims Township. You'll see at the right side of the building iconic buildings from this community, including Fort Ancient, um, Fort Ancient culture, early settlements like the Ross Family Log Cabin, and of course, John Cleve Sims, who the township is named for, um, as well as Camp Denison and some others. The backside of the building depicts Sims growth and industry, including early mill, farming, and the Little Miami Railroad, as well as the Loveland Castle. On the left side of the building, you'll continue your journey through the 20th century with landmarks such as the early schoolhouse and the Sea Mead House. This panel also features natural beauty of the Little Miami River and its surrounding landscape. The front of the building leaves the viewer in present day Sims Township, celebrating the area's beautiful homes and active community. The other elements featured in the design nod to Ohio State symbolism and patriotism in honor of this mural's home within Home of the Brave Park. The mural's color palette is bright and energetic, reflecting the Sims Township itself and our vibrant, thriving community. Now it is my honor to welcome up the team who created this mural. A huge thanks to our incredible artworks team. Again, lead artist Jim Effler. Junior teaching artist Braylon Bell, who just had to hop out, but yes, thank you. And our youth apprentices, James Giesecke, Darian Hassert, Aria Haven, and Josie Massett. I'd also like to thank my former colleague, Laura Houston, for all of her work shepherding this project throughout the summer. Team, if you would take a moment to say your age and uh, where you live and what school you go to. I don't know if you want. <laughs> I'm not saying my age. <laughs> my name's Darian Hassert. I'm 19 and I attend the University of Cincinnati and I live in Forest Park. I'm James Giesecke. I, um, I go to LaSalle High School. Um, what school do you go? Like, where are you from? Uh, I live in uh, Hyde Park in Cincinnati. I'm Josie Massett, I'm 21, I'm from Sims Township, so we're representing, and I go to Miami University. My name's Aria Haven, I'm 21 years old, and I'm also from Sims Township, so. Earlier on, I passed out a couple of pieces of paper to some of you in the crowd. If you wouldn't mind sharing with your neighbor, uh, we'd now like to share with you a beautiful tradition that we have at Artworks that formerly helps us dedicate um, our, our works of art. So this is called our dedication poem, 
And if you have a friend nearby you and you want to read along, and team, I'd love your help on this too. If you want to crowd around here. All right, so at the count of three, we'll all say this together if you don't mind. All right, one, two, three. Public oh art brings, brings color, color energy, energy, and life. And life. It, it inspires, inspires connection, connection, conversation, conversation and, and empathy. empathy. It, it empowers, empowers neighborhoods and reflects the vibrancy of our communities. Together, Together we, we are transforming, transforming our community. community. It, it is with great pride and love that we transfer ownership of this work of art from our hands to the hearts of the people of Sims Township. Thank you everyone for joining us today. Thank you, Marie. Thank you so much, Bill. Thank you everyone for being here. I just want to a uh, couple uh, last announcements. First of all, I'd like to thank Judge Heather Russell for being here in attendance. Yes, yay Judge. Also, Joe Rossi from the Rossi family in the back. He's, he's staying in the way back, but yes, he has, has all the history of these 49 acres. He'd be glad to share with you. Um, also want to point out that uh, we have a scavenger hunt pertaining to the mural. See Jody Lease, she has the forms for the scavenger hunt and there's prizes and it's for any age. Yes, that's key. And then also please uh, partake in the refreshments we have over here. We've got a cookout, Kona ice, drinks, so please dig in. And thank you again, everyone, for being here.